Welcome to New This Week at EE Web in partnership with Mauser, where each week we feature some new and interesting products. This week we have ST Micro's line of STM32 Nucleo development boards, TI's F28027F Piccolo MCUs, and an RF linear regulator from analog devices. The STM32 Nucleo development boards from ST Micro provide an easy to use and extensible development platform with the performance and features of an STM32 microcontroller. The board is available with an ARM Cortex M0, M3, or M4 and is expandable via an Arduino Uno R3 header and the ST Morpho connector, which has access to all the STM32 IOs. There is an onboard debugger and programmer, and the board is embed enabled, allowing for development using the tools on embed.org or any standard IDE, such as those from Kyle or IAR. Texas Instruments F28027F Piccolo MCUs with InstaSpin FOC are purpose built microcontrollers for three phase field oriented motor control applications. The devices are based on TI's C28X core and add their InstaSpin FOC functionality. This package helps reduce control system design time and complexity. InstaSpin FOC features include built in motor parameter identification, field boosting for increased torque, field weakening for increased speed, and TI's universal fast software encoder, which enables 100% torque at startup. The analog device's ADM7151 RF linear regulator is an 800 milliamp ultra low noise regulator designed for noise sensitive applications. It features a PSRR of greater than 90 dB from 1 kHz to 100 kHz, 1.6 microvolts RMS noise from 10 Hz to 100 kHz, and noise spectral density of 1.7 nanovolts per root hertz from 10 kHz to 1 MHz. The ADM7151's input can range from 4.5 to 16 volts, and the output is adjustable from 1.5 to 4 volts at up to 800 milliamps. Thanks for joining us this week. You can find all of this week's products on mauser.com.